Hey guys, what's up? Today I'm going to show you how to convert any video file on your PC and your Mac to a, any other video file. So what we're going to do is we're going to download free video converter. And this is free, obviously, in the title it says it's free. And these are all the things it can um, uh, export. It can also download YouTube videos. What we're going to do now is we're going to add a file to our VLC. Or not VLC. AVC. So now we're going to do add video. We're going to look for our video. Well, here's my video. It's on my desktop. This is a .wmv. I want to convert it to an MP4 or an MPEG video. What we're going to do is go into profile. I'm going to choose from here. These are our common audio files. So formats. So if you want to change something like M to an MP3 to put it on your iPod, you can do that. And here are your video files, flash video, and something for like an iPod touch. I'm going to choose MP4. It's already customized. This is where you're going to choose your codec, your size, your bitrate, and your frame rate. Your size is pretty much how you know it's an HD. Anything that, like, um, 120, 1,200 1, by 720, that's HD. And you can also download from YouTube. Your file is going to end up on your desktop when you're done recording or converting. Now I'm going to show you how to do this on the Mac. Hey guys, now I'm going to show you how to do it on a Mac. What we're going to do is we're going to go click on more info in the description box and you're going to download VLC. Now that we have VLC downloaded, we're going to go into File, Advanced Open File. And first we're going to have a .flv file that we want to convert, or any file you want to convert. I downloaded a video from my YouTube page. Now we're going to browse for our file. Here's my file. I'm going to click open. Now we're going to click this box and we're going to do settings. Now this is where we're going to output it. So I'm going to put it on my desktop and I'm going to cha change it to be um, video.mp4. I don't know why I did two M's. So now we're going to click save. We're going to click video and audio. This is an HD setting for your vi for your videos. An MP3, everyone knows what an MP3 is. Now we're going to have 128, 1, 128, and 2. These are our video. This is for our audio, and this is for our video. You don't always have to have a video in your file. Say you wanted to download an audio file from YouTube, and you just want to put it on your iPod. Then, then you would just click audio. But now what we're going to do, in my case, is we're going to click OK, and then we're going to click Open. Up here you can see that it's converting the file right as we speak. And then it's going to come up right here, and it's going to be a QuickTime video. As you can see, it's QuickTime X because I'm running Snow Leopard on this machine. But when it's done, we'll have a video file just downloaded from YouTube. Some of you may wonder, how did I download my YouTube video so easily without an extra program? Well, what I did is I went to YouTube, and I went to My Videos, and this doesn't have to be your video. I went, okay, so let's just choose a random one. How to create buttons for your website. So, in this Safari, for Safari, what you're going to do is you're going to go to Window, Activity. See, now, how to create buttons for your website. So this is all the stuff that's going on, on this YouTube website right now. But look at this. Right here, this is the video. And it's loading. Look at that. That's the, I'm downloading the YouTube video right now. And what you're going to do, how to do this, is to find the one with megabyte. With megabytes. This is 14.5 megabytes. Everything else is a killbyte or just a plain old byte. So, anything that's a megabyte is your video file. This is the same for any YouTube video that you come across on YouTube. So this has been a very combined YouTube video, how to convert video files on a PC, how to convert video files on a Mac, and how to download videos from YouTube. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one.